On the menu today, sponsored by PCB Way. In a recent video, I tried to fix a common problem with the Amiga, that high-res and low-res graphics come out of two different ports, leading to a lot of frustrating channel changing. And I mostly solved it by installing this push-button HDMI switcher, but it wouldn't auto-switch, because that depends on the sources turning their signal off completely. That is, until the RGB2 HDMI team saw my video and fixed it, adding an option to the menu so if the device displays a blank screen, it will turn the video output off. And by using this priority HDMI switcher, the vampire doesn't even need to do the same. This lets you set a priority HDMI input that it will always fall back to when the other input turns off. So does it work? Yes. When I load a low-res game, the HDMI switches itself over, and when I quit the game, it switches back completely automatically. Grab the updated firmware and this switch from the description below, and cheerio.